Well, one, one thing that I think is so worth mentioning is that something like a leopard gecko off, you know, I've already mentioned it gets thrown into the beginner species. It gets thrown into kind of the boring species and the common species. And all you have to do is actually do what you've done here and spend time jumping into the weeds as far as research and, and no, knowing the natural habitat and learning about the, the, the area they live in and the plants and, and everything. And that is incredibly rewarding and exciting. And it suddenly takes a species that people might call boring or common and it, it just bursts it with life, uh, an Absolutely. exciting project. And I hate it. Somebody actually did say to me on social media once that um, leopard geckos are simple. And I was, like, I was thinking, yeah. you're simple. <laughs> It's a big yeah. It's true. Yeah, it's true. What leopard geckos are is they're rugged, so they can handle any type of care. And that's the problem, right? Is that they can just handle this wide berth of care, so it doesn't force people to try to replicate their natural habitat. But when you actually do, they're not simple. They're incredibly complex, just like.